Something about the way you move Makes me wanna feel your groove Something about the way you dress, baby Got me feeling like you made What's up my beautiful people? How are you doing? Uh, welcome back to uh, my YouTube channel. Guys, uh, today is uh, actually on a Sunday. I've been actually uh, having some rest uh, from the time uh, we met. So uh, the last time we met I was actually traveling uh, back uh, to to Mombasa and uh, you know I actually reached here around uh, some uh, few minutes to four. So I uh, took some days off, that's why I haven't uh, posted anything uh, since then. So and uh, we, to add on that, you know, the rains uh, were here and, uh, you know, the place was uh, a little bit floody. So uh, like actually where I am in right now, uh, today the sun is actually out. That's why I decided to take this chance and uh, show you one of the places that uh, you might want to see. So uh, that is that. So today I'm in uh, one of the estates here in uh, Mombasa so this is uh, Shanzu so Shanzu is one of the estates that also have uh, interesting uh, buildings in this place so it's uh, not I, I will say it's a cheap place but it's actually a, a place with uh, actually class so it's just right next opposite uh, right, right next to uh, Nyali so from Nyali this is Shanzu so Shanzu is a bit uh, uh, not as big as uh, Nyali but uh, today I just want to show you around and uh, just for you guys to see uh, what actually is in uh, Shanzu so uh, right over here this is uh, the famous club it's called uh, volume so this is the volume club and you can see there are some uh, beautiful apartments over there the others over there these are other beautiful apartments so right over here this is the Shanzu garden these are also other houses that you find in this place so you'll see it's not uh, the ordinary uh, estate that uh, you will find around so I'm going to drive around uh, as I show you the place and uh, for you to see how beautiful Shanzu is so let's hop in So that is the volume, it's one, uh, one of the known clubs in this place, so that is volume. So there are several apartments over here which are quite nice, as you can see, I don't know what that is but you can see how beautiful this place is. right over here and we have some other apartments and uh, the beaches are uh, just around this place so I'll try and uh, find a place where I can show you you know uh, the beach just for you to see how uh, the beach that is here in Shanzu actually looks like so there are also hotels in these places and uh, right ahead uh, there is a um, Pride Inn hotel right over there and uh, there's also Sarova here in this place so let me just show you this place for for you just to see what is actually uh, is here in uh, Shanzu some buildings are also old like, like this one right over here it actually looks a little bit old so this is also a Swiss consulate. So if you're looking for anything to do with the uh, Swiss, yeah. So you can see 
see how the place is cool as well. The roads are actually uh, also not as busy as uh, some of the estates. So uh, it's a nice place where you can just come and uh, jog. So you can jog here in the morning if you're a person who, lo who loves fitness. And, uh, the beach is right over there. So I'll try and find a way uh, to reach uh, the beach for me. Just to show you Shanzu Beach. So there are also other hotels that are abandoned right over here. So Pride Inn is right over here. So there is a Pride Inn Paradise. So right over there, those are other apartments that are being developed right over here. So this road right over here is the one that is going to take you all the way to where we started our video. So club volume is right at the farthest end. So right this way, these are other, other parts of Shanzu. So there's a small uh, center over here. You can see there is a restaurant over there. There is a barber shop. There's a car wash right over here. There are restaurants. There's a small club. And uh, this is the main entrance to the Pride Inn. So the place is uh, very busy, as you can see. And you can see how people actually uh, do live in this place so today the sun is uh, very hot and uh, you will see people just in the, the, in the sheds so these are some of the clothes that uh, you might want to buy if you're living in this place and uh, you happen to have uh, not carried uh, swimming attire so you can just buy one over there and uh, go have fun Continental Resort Mombasa right over here this is also one known hotel in this place so So you can actually tell how the place actually is. So let me check this way to Kilua. So some of the apartments are actually over here. So I think these ones are also... You can 
see the happy park chair living right over there. The others are being built just behind it. And you can see how cool this place is. So right over here, this is another place. So you can see how uh, many trees are there. So I think it's part of the, the hotel. So you can see there are several cameras over there. It's a very secured place. So I'm going to go, I'm going to take this road right over here. So uh these are actually places where people do live in these places. So the kind of houses that you actually find here can actually tell you the type of class that is found in this place. So Shanzu is a place known for the rich or known for the people who are able and uh, it's actually uh, have it actually has a Modern, modern apartments in these places and there are several nice hotels as well in these places so right over here this is, I think is another hotel part of uh, riding I don't know and uh, right over here this is uh, the Kilua I've been here and, uh, it's actually a very nice place so you can see how how calm this place is these are actually people who i think they reside in this place so they're just uh taking a stroll um, so uh this is now shanzu so uh these are also uh, other other apartments in these places That is the Royal Shaza. Very good. So these are the types of houses that are when you're living in them, uh, every day feels like you are actually in holiday because uh, they have a sea view, and uh, you know when you just open your windows. Uh, <laughs> You can see this is La Mera beach apartment. So the beach is just right there, right on the other side. So every day is a holiday in this place. You wake up to the breeze of the ocean. So you can see these are just horses that are being grazed. So that one tells you that this this place is just not for for everybody. So uh, I want to see what we can actually get from this place, or uh, we just turn back. So uh, another thing you realize about uh, these uh, beautiful places uh, that the fact that they are so they, 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 the apartments that are in these places are actually very beautiful and uh, if you are a person who don't like uh, congested places this is the place because you can see this house right over here it's a very beautiful house and uh, you know they've made their balconies to face the breeze the beach side so uh, that's the beach and the place is not actually uh, crowded so you get the full breeze and uh, this is just pure pure nature so if you're a person of nature and uh, you're looking for a place to live Shanzu is the place See how beautiful that apartment is. Very
So these are also other apartments. Over here, these are, these are another go to the beach. So the beach is right behind them. Yeah, guys so you know i had to uh, leave the car side just for me to uh, walk with you to uh, this uh, busy part of uh, shanzo so uh, this is the corner so this, this one takes you to the to the one of the fam uh, famous hotels called kilua is it a hotel i think it's an hotel kilua then uh, right over here this is uh, the way to pride in and then uh, all the way to the volume club so I'm gonna walk you uh, right through uh, this place and uh, show you some of the activities that uh, actually uh, take place in these uh, in these uh, small small uh, market of Shanzu. So right over here you can see these are these are restaurants. This is a, this is a bar and. Uh, Okay. And uh, you know, being a uh, being a weekend, uh, uh, we expect uh, people to be in these places. So you can see uh, the kind of shops that are actually found this found in these places. So this actually tells you that this is a tourist destination place. So uh, there is a restaurant over there. There are shops, shops. Right over here, I think this is one big hotel that is being constructed over here. So, uh, some of, and some of the shops. Sierra Leo. So some, some of the shops right over here, these are massage parlors as well. So, 
you can just tell with the way uh, the shops are actually uh, built so That's a very beautiful hat. So, uh, this is a marketplace actually goes all the way to uh, the white building that is found on the farthest end. So yeah, after a thorough search of a uh, uh, way to access the beach, I've actually uh, uh, seen one. So there's one that uh, I've taken. This is uh, taking us all the way to Serena Beach. So I think it's named after the Serena Hotel. So that is where I'm going to take you. So the road is this way. So you know how to leave the vehicle back. Uh, before I take this route so it's a very narrow road, road so I believe that's why but that's why they don't uh, yeah, they ca let cars uh, go down this way so it's a distance but uh, I can see the beach right over there So you can actually see how uh, this place this is uh, this is what they call uh, Serena Beach. So this is part of uh, Shanzu Beach. So there's another part right over there which uh, we, we can't access right now because you know the water is already uh, I think it's uh, coming back and you know these issues of mine they already have uh, them right over there so it won't be possible for us to see the other side of the beach so uh, you can see the, the way this place is uh, very beautiful like right over here they are actually uh, there's the place right over there so you can just uh, uh, enjoy yourself uh, the breeze and uh, you can see how beautiful the the ocean is so there's there's actually uh, a strong breeze I, I don't I'm not sure if you can actually hear hear me but there's a, a strong wave so right over here you can actually see that's a ship over there so this is uh, another place where you can just enjoy yourself uh, the movements of these ships around this place so you can see how beautiful these coconuts actually coconut trees actually look with the breeze this is the vibe that i actually uh, live to die for 
So this is a very beautiful place, guys. So for people who don't like uh, crowded places, Shanzu is the place for you. So uh, you can actually see how uh, this place has a white sand, and the beach is actually uh, clean as well. So I believe the other side is also uh, the same. They actually boats over there. So <coughs> just uh, see how beautiful uh, this this place is. And people pay, actually do pay a lot of money just to come and access this place. So if you happen to be in the coast next time, please come and uh, enjoy this beach. So guys, as you can see, Shanzu Beach is actually not as big as uh, some of the other beach. So, and uh, there are several interesting things you can uh, actually do here. Like right over there, that is a camel. So you can take uh, the camel right around this place. So that is, uh, I believe, the Pride Inn. This is uh, uh, this is Serena. So this is called the Serena Beach. So they actually also both right over here, so they can. Uh, they uh, take you around the ocean just for you to have a look and I uh, believe there's also another park they call Barren Park right just right around this place where you can go and uh, see the fish that are actually in this place so I'm not gonna cross to the other side because you, you can see right over there there's uh, the water's already uh, 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 returned and uh, with the shoes that I'm wearing it won't be uh, quite possible for me to go to the other side so right over there, there's another ship that is crossing over. I believe it's going to the southern part of Africa. Maybe it is Tanzania or something, I don't know. <coughs> so that is also one thing that people who, who sit here just next to the beach actually get to enjoy as uh, they sunbed or uh, enjoy the beautiful sunrise. So you can see the sun is right over there, just about to set. So you can see how uh, there are several people right over there that are actually uh, from uh, the beach. So the beach being a small place, you know, there are several activities that are actually taking place over right over there. So if you are happen to be staying in the hotels right over here, you can see the beautiful beach you can see right over there and uh, with the ships that are just passing. I mean the breeze, the place is just a vibe. and. Uh, it's a place where you want to be every day so uh, and uh, for the guys who are living just around Shanzu you can actually as well uh, come and visit this place so these are some of the people that I believe are living around this place so with them as well they are actually enjoying uh, the beach of Shanzu this is called uh, Serena Beach so there are also bit boys over here and there are not as many as uh, uh, the other places uh, that we've uh, gone to like I said Yani so this is also one of the places uh, you might want to live if you're a person who actually don't uh, don't like crowded places 
If you're a person who loves uh, places where uh, uh, their nature, there's nature around. So this is one place you can actually uh, live when you're in this place. So guys, uh, that's it uh, for Shanzu and uh, for today. And uh, I believe uh, you've enjoyed this video. You've, uh, I believe you've actually seen something about uh, Shanzu. And you know, Shanzu being a very uh, uh, less congested place, uh, it's not actually known by uh, many people. So if you happen to be in the coast and uh, you want to see this place, you can uh, just come right over here and uh, and. Uh, check this place out if you haven't subscribed kindly subscribe like this video hit the notification bell so just for you, for you to get uh, notified every time i post so uh see you till next time guys bye bye love you